This ranch is a great cattle ranch. It makes perfect sense to run cattle here. It's not gonna be a better golf course. It's not gonna be a better shopping center. This is what this land was made for. I'm David Crow. Uh, we, my family owns the Parks Ranch. Uh, it's a cow-calf operation. It is a family operation. My father and I work together. We're on the coastal prairie in South Texas. We're about 60 miles from the Gulf of Mexico. This ranch has a lot of history to it. Colonel Fannin surrendered his army to Santa Ana's troops on this ranch, which is an integral part of the Five for Independence for the state of Texas. So that's that's a real plus for this ranch. It's, it's really a, a cool part of it. The, the ranch has been owned by the Parks family since 1860 and we purchased it in 2000. I'm a first generation rancher, Matt's a second generation. We don't get bogged down in, in the way things used to be done. We're always looking forward on better ways for us to manage our cattle, manage the ranch. When we bought the ranch, it was just divided into two pastures and it was for more or less continuous grazing. So we switched to rotational grazing. We have 10 pastures and we have two different herds that are grazing in two different pastures on a, any given time. And by doing that, it allows us to rest eight pastures and that allows our grass to, uh, to recover and to give the pastures the necessary rest they need. We've put in probably 20 miles of fence, if not more on this ranch. It's created a, a grazing plan that's sustainable, it works. It gives you an opportunity to, to survive a drought. When it does get dry, you still have grass you can rotate into, and the pastures you come out to, it gives them an opportunity to rest, and when it does rain, they come back. We spend a lot of our budget on brush control and combating a lot of invasive species. Brush control is, is, is very important for us because if we don't stay on top of it, that brush keeps coming back. We use primarily crop dusters. We also do a lot of IPT work, individual plant treatment. It has been very beneficial to us as far as grass growth goes. This is supposed to be open prairie. Right now we're doing our best to keep the open areas open. You have to manage this land. And the best way to do it for not only the land, but the biodiversity, the wildlife, the cattle are an integral part of that. My dad and I are always striving to, to make the land better at the Parks Ranch. It's not only our job, it's our passion. We're doing our best to take care of this land for the next generation. If you don't take care of this land, it's not gonna take care of you. You've got a partnership with the land. It's not about being a cowboy, it's, it's about being a steward of the land. To be a steward of the land means that you're, you're in it day in and day out through good times and bad times. I hope the Parks Ranch stays intact as an operating working ranch for generations to come.